<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Seven Days to Die. I'm the Radio Man 03. It's awesome to have you along. I've done nothing since the last episode. Waiting for the sun to come up. I've got one or two zombies outside waiting for me. <laughs> they don't know I'm in here. I'm undetected. You can see undetected, but they're out here. They just keep roaming around, moaning and groaning and freaking me out. Um, let's take a look at a few things real quick. First of all, our stats. Food's down to 25. Water's down to 31. We're going to take care of that real fast by coming down here and we're going to eat this meat. That's going to help us out. We're going to drink some water. Oh, that's going to help us out too. We're going to drink another water. That should get us up well up there. There's 81%. Okay, so we'll go back to... Uh, oh my god, these guys have just been roaming around down here. We're going to eat a few more. A little more food. Come on, eat that bacon and eggs. There you go. There you go. Where's that going to get us up to? 69%. I think I should probably hold off on eating anymore. It might be a waste. First of all, thank you for letting me know the night vision goggles. If I put those on, if I hit F, they will turn on. Okay, so let me let me bring up to speed with what I have done overnight. First of all, um, I have what I want with us to take with us. I've got some extra water, some snowballs to make more water, all our materials, building materials, uh, useful materials to, to build with and stuff. I've got an extra storage chest to take with us. I have our grill. I have our cooking pot. A couple of extra bones. We've got a few frames. We're going to put those guys right down here and 116 arrows. Now, what else I did was right in here, I've added a an extra stone axe, a bow, some arrows, a club, and ex a, a thing of water right here. That's just in case we die and wind up back here. At least there's some food back up here. The snowballs, I'll leave there as well. I've got a splint here too. We've got a splint. We've got some painkillers. So we're, we're pretty good. I'm not sure how much of this stuff I should be showing uh, at the beginning. But uh, if you're new like me, and I am, I am the definition of noob right now, then uh, yeah. I thought so. There's a bird's nest over here. Look at this. This is crazy. Okay. All right. Sweet. It's 4 a.m. Let's go see who's out here. These guys have been roaming around all night long, scaring the crap out of me. Oh, my God, you guys. I've been so excited about getting on here and playing again. Did they leave? We're going to head out this door quick. We'll see if they're out here. Uh, two zombies. What the heck happened to them? Club. Really? There's our moldy bread. What happened to them? All night. All night they've been out here terrorizing me. <laughs> and then the sun comes up and they take off. Is that a thing? Oh, I hear one. Okay, to, today's episode, we're heading for Trader Joe. Or the Trader's Place. Trader Joel, I guess his name is. Trader Joel. We're going to head that direction, which is south. Um, I just don't know where that zombie took off to. But we'll, we'll figure it out. And I also want to find a town. we got to get going here on this stuff. I, I've... Am I playing right? Am I playing too safe at night? I, I feel like I might be playing a little bit too safe at night, like I should be doing something to to better myself during the nighttime hours. But I feel like until I get some place where we're set up, um, I need to be I need to take it easy. Uh, over the weekend, uh, I was not able to record any seven days to die. I wanted to, but I just did not get a chance to. Uh, Variety wound up going to bed on Saturday night. Yeah, I'm going to blame her. <laughs> My wife went to bed on Saturday night. And I thought, well, I can't record while she's in bed. That's just going to make too much noise and this and that. So I didn't do it. But I did load up another seed, a random seed, and just kind of roamed around and tried the game out just to see if I could make myself feel a little more confident about the game. Let me tell you, I died by day two, halfway day two, day two I died. Uh, dysentery, infected, and uh, completely annihilated by the enemy. For sure. Uh, I wound up eaten by some uh, zombies. Map. Okay, we want to go south. Uh, let's see. I wanted to do this before we left the house. I want to go map, and I want to go... The trader, the trader is down this way here. So let's right-click on that, and quick waypoint. Now it should come up on our compass and show us which direction we need to go, right? There it is, right there. Bingo. Okay, so off we go. I need some stone. We're almost out of stone. We're low on the wood as well, but we can grab a lot of that stuff as we go. But I'm going to go ahead and grab this node right here and uh, get this started. 
Yeah, you know, that's weird. The zombies were there and then they were gone. I see one down the hill here from me, but uh, he's kind of in the shadows. Oh, good. That's 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 busted. Okay, so let's get rid of that one. Let's scrap. Let's make a new one. Stone axe. Craft. <coughs> Excuse me. I've been really excited about playing. I really um, am excited about playing this game. It, it, it seems like so much fun. Um, the terror level is something else, man. I tell you, I just, you know, I'm just do cotton. There we go. Let's grab that cotton. Let me know if the graphics are too dark, too. The game terrifies me. It really does. Um, Saturday night, so it's really late, okay? It's like 1 o'clock in the morning, and I'm just kind of fooling around, trying to see if I can make it and survive. And I, I loaded up a, a seed called Sweet Mama, and I've tried it before, and I died on that one as well. I didn't die, but I, I got to the point where I couldn't do anything else anymore. I was in such horrible shape. So I wind up infected. I wind up with dysentery because I don't have any water because it spawns you in a desert and I just didn't have any uh, water. And I was stupid enough to throw all my uh, aloe vera on the ground <laughs> to make room for, I don't know, something stupid, probably. And um, yeah, got into a town and it, there was a store that said pills. And I thought, oh man, it's got pills. That's what I need. I need some medicine. I'll, I'll find some antibiotics in there for sure. Well, as soon as I open up the store, there is a Doberman in there. <laughs> a dog, yeah. And uh, a zombie dog, and he killed me. Uh, well, he didn't kill me, actually. I killed him. I killed the gal that was in the store with him. And I thought, okay, this is this is going okay. But then, eventually, I, I was just so injured that I, I died. Oh, there's a there's a sweet little lady down here. Oh, oh, all right, let's get our arrows back on. Hello, honey. Mama. Sweet mama. Come here, you. There we go. I'll take that. Okay, so we're heading for the trader. Uh, back to one. Anyways, um, yeah, I, I succeeded in terrifying myself quite, quite well. Today's episode, I would like to find the, the trader's place and take care of that last quest up in the right-hand corner. Get that taken care of. We'll just leave that zombie alone. He doesn't look like he's going to have anything for me anyways. Um, and um, find a town. Find some place where we can get started, because I know... And, and thank you guys for all your tips, too. You guys have been really fantastic. Matter of fact... Um, oh. Oh, as a nurse. We want her. She might have some antibiotics on her. Hey, sweet pea. Come over down here. Come down here, baby. That's it. That a girl. I should crouch. You guys have told me. Crouch and pick up those extra points for shooting. Does she not know we're here? Oh, she does not know we're here. Well, let's just get her. It's like she's stuck right there, huh? Yeah, she's kind of stuck. Please have antibiotics on you. Nothing. No problem. No problem. All right, so I'm going to grab a little more of this cotton so we can make some extra bandages with it. We'll turn it into cloth and we'll have that going for us. Uh, I know some of you guys are watching and some of you were like, oh, great, a noob's playing. <laughs> so that's great. I'm glad you're happy to hear that. I'm hoping I can entertain you with it. I, I don't want to be too boring. I don't know how much of this I should bring or not bring because, I mean, some folks are just as new to the game as I am. So I, I don't want to leave anybody out. But I feel like a lot of this you guys have seen over and over and over again. So, you know, um, wow, this is quite the ravine, isn't it? I do see a tree stump over here, though, that I'd like to check out. Uh, goals today, get to the trader, uh, pick up some goodies along the way, of course. Uh, there's, some, there's some tin. Here's some trash. Bird's nest, we want to hit those up. Some glue, okay, so I know I can make... Um... Oh, there's a big old guy. There's a big dude. Do you see him? I can hear him. Thumping about. I don't know if he's going to have anything good on him. We should kill him, though. He's going to take a while to kill, though. He's a big fella. Did I hear a buzzard? No, there's just another zombie up on the hill here. Where's he going? What? What, what is this? What is this all about? Does he not know how to come after us because we're on these this hill like this? 
Come here, big guy. Going for headshots. I'm hoping that's going to give me the most points. Oh, you. No! Oh, God, I might die. Oh, shoot, that was close. We use this bandage. Whew. He better have something good on him. Oh, he's not dead. Okay, that's the last time I do that right off the bat. Especially at this stage of the game. Oh my god, come on, radio, hit that guy. Oh my god, hit him, hit him, hit him. One more headshot. Holy cow, this guy's durable. Level up. Holy cow, look at this guy. It's amazing. It's about freaking time, dude. Wow, you are just unbelievable. Nothing. Oh, man, I took that hit for nothing. But we leveled up. That's good. Health is at 73%. We should be okay. We're okay. We're not bleeding. We're not doing anything like that. Uh, perks. You guys were talking about perks. Oh, my God. That really kind of just rattled me a little bit right there. For sure. Where is the Trader Joe at? We need to make sure we stay on course for that. Okay, we're going this way. Um, the perks. I believe the Minor 69 is the next one you guys suggested I pick up. And then there was a kind of a... Kind of a standard uh, process of perks that we're going to want to grab hold of at the beginning here to to, to get going right. So uh, I'm going to look back at the comments on that one and we'll do that. I think right now I do want the minor 69 though. Uh, let's go um, N. M I minor 69, minor 69. This one right here, we've got the points for it. So I'm going to buy that. And I think that's all I'm going to do this episode. And then you guys can tell me what you think of that. How, do, how, do, how it is, is. Is that a good idea? And I'll look back at the comments. Because one of you really listed out just how to do it. And, and, the, and a good route to take. Nothing. Uh, let's go back into our inventory. Uh, bandage. Bandages. Let's max that. Oh, I need to make the cloth first, huh? I need to make the cloth. Cloth fragments. Craft. Okay, beautiful. Okay, so we're going to get those going, and then we can make some bandages. I don't have a lot of stone on me. Thank God that big guy did not infect us. Trying to keep my eyes open for wolves. And bird's nests, too. Oh, here comes another stump. So, yeah, I guess I'm taking you guys with me day by day. Uh, seventh, the, the seventh day, we're going to have the horde right. The fifth day, we have a dog horde. So, by day four, I would like to know exactly where we're going to be. And get started on uh, our first sort of horde... Uh, protective structure that we can be in and fight the horde and uh, not get completely obliterated by it. And I, I think the way I want to work it too, and I've been watching uh, some Let's Plays, mostly uh, Games for Kicks. I enjoy him because he's um, uh, very enthusiastic about the game. I really like his energy about it, and, and that's how I like to be too. I like to really be into a game when I'm playing it, and I, he j it just feels to me like he's really into it. So I've been watching him. And uh, enjoying it very much. It's been a lot of fun. And it, it kind of got me in the mood of this. And then you guys have suggested it so many times. So that's why I looked it up. I thought, I went back and looked at comments. I thought, okay, what game is everybody really kind of asking me to play? And it was this one. Seven Days to Die uh, comes up, like I said, I think in the first episode, a lot. People really wanted to see this. So I thought, what the heck? Is this clay? Looks like it's clay, huh? Uh, 
Uh, was that clay? I've got some sand on me. I'm going to drop the sand. Did I not pick up the clay? Crushed sand. What happened to the clay I was picking up? I thought I picked up clay. Maybe it was stone. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. That's weird. I'm not seeing it in my inventory. Let's try that again. Remember, I'm learning here, guys. No, I'm picking up stone. That's all stone. Okay, so never mind. Oop. A little jittery there. Some trash. A little bit of oil. Uh, we'll probably sell the oil off, huh? To the trader. I think we're getting pretty close to him. I'm not getting anywhere fast. I'll tell you what, I'm going to keep going. Uh, I don't want to drag you guys through all this, so that's all I'm doing is I'm going to pick up resources along the way. Bird's nests, uh, stones, uh, wood, stuff like that, and then just keep on going. I mean, I'm, your skill in construction tools is now level 9, so that's cool. We're going up. We're going the right direction. Uh, it's a bummer the, 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 big, the big guy got me, but uh, I think we're going to be okay with that. We could eat some food and probably be okay with that. But yeah, we need all of this to get set up. Now, oh, wait, I was, talk I was talking about the base. I got distracted by the big fella. My base, I think what I want to do is whatever we build at the beginning, I want it to morph into what we continue to build on. I don't, wanna, I don't even want to deal with this guy. Uh, we're almost at the trader. We're almost to the trader. I want it to continue to expand and become our base. I don't want to build a little base and then move on and go build another little base and build a little base and build a little base. I want to build something that we're going to be able to change and alter along the way and make better and better. So that is kind of where I'm wrapping my head around and I've got an idea in my head and I'm going to try it out and see. Um, not that it's never been done before, but you know, we'll, we'll, we'll give it a whirl. But I've got this idea in my head. And, oh, look at you. Hey, Burt Reynolds, buddy. What's up there? What's up there, Mr. Eastbound and Down? Let's get even ground with this guy. Oh, my God, you're fast. Back of the head. Got to do an arrow check here. Ooh, what's it? What's that there? Ooh, let's go in here. Let's take a look. What is this? Scrap chest armor schematic. Ooh. Okay. That's cool. Some armor. All right. I like that idea. That's nice. Nothing on the cowboy, though. Killed one of them cowboys once, and I wound up getting a... Um, the hunting rifle off of him, and oh man, I tell you that one—that thing, that that rifle is sweet. It's a one-shot rifle. It takes a while to load, but I tell you what, it'll put these boys down real quick, real quick. It does. Uh, so that's my idea for the base. I'm gonna keep on walking here and just keep doing what I'm doing. Uh, we're we're mornings. We got the longest day possible. So I'm gonna grab the resources and I'll meet you guys back up when I get uh, hopefully to the trader, or if anything else happens and you know I screw up on another fight or something like that, I'll bring you back and we'll. Take a look at that. Welcome back. We've not gone very far. This guy's interesting looking. His skull is like showing. Wow. That is a crazy looking zombie. Nasty looking guy. Holy crap, he's nasty. We're coming up on a desert, which is going to be a nice thing to see, which is a great thing to see. I'm pretty happy about this. Uh, this means we can make some more medical bandages if we get some aloe vera. So I'm going to grab just a little bit more of this. And then we're going to head down to this desert. And I believe there's a house way out there in the distance. So that's a good thing. 
Uh, where's the Trader Joe at? He's over this way, though. So, let's see. Do I have space in my inventory? Is he hunting us? I think he is hunting us. I got a bunch of arrows going, too. I love shooting the bow. Three more oil. Nice. Um, so yeah, let's get some aloe vera. Let's let's check our inventory. We have any space left in here? We do not. Um, uh, let's see. We've got snow. That's great. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's turn these guys into cloth. Cloth fragment. Let's favorite that. Let's max that out and craft those up. That's going to give us a little space, and we can get rid of this one here. Uh, and that's going to give us, and we're going to dump the sand, too. Uh, the brass I'm going to scrap for now. I don't think I should be doing that, but I'm going to just so we've got a little space so I can pick up some of this aloe vera. These yucca plants are food. And, I mean, it's such an easy source of food. It is unbelievable. Did he see me? He did see me, unfortunately. I hit this guy. This guy sucks so bad. He's so jittery. Yeah, he's got no he's got no shirt on. I mean, what could he possibly be carrying? It's like the stripper. She's got no top. It's like, what are you carrying that I could possibly want? Did I check this trash bag? Oh, I did not. Oh, I did not. Okay, nothing in there. Okay, so now let's 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 do some yuccas. I want to get a stack of these guys because these guys are like easy food. You see the fruit on top. By the way, if you guys didn't know it, I'm in Arizona. I live in Arizona, and this game is based out of Arizona, a county in Arizona, not a real county, of course. There's no county named uh, what this game is named, but um, uh, it, it, I'm definitely from Arizona. So I think what I can do here is aloe. I can make aloe cream. Let's do that. Uh, what? What? No, 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 no. Al. Oh. Okay. Let's do that. Favorite. Okay. Then let's go back to uh, bandages. There is a first aid bandage. I can't craft one yet because I need. What? Why can't I craft one yet? First aid bandages can stop bleeding and restore some health. Uh, oh, the aloe cream's not been made yet. Okay, so that's that's fine. So we're waiting for that to be made, and then we can go ahead and make those um, those bandages. So, yeah, desert is a, a great find, a great find. Matter of fact, I wouldn't mind keeping this close by to us wherever we go because it is going to be very handy for this aloe and these yucca fruit. Uh, let's take a look at the yucca fruit, those of you who may not know it. Uh, yucca fruit right here. We're going to take these guys and put them down where the blocks are, and we're going to uh, gobble them up. It gives you two uh, food, I believe, each time. Now our food's gone up to 40%. It's going to give us some of our health back as well. So nice and easy does it. And it's going to be coming back. But this this area here is uh, sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. No oh, bird nest. Uh, oh, I got no room for feathers. Um, our shiv is good. We can pick up another shiv by just killing another zombie. So we can... Oh, whoa. I still can't pick that up. Um, oh my gosh, what am I going to do here? Uh, I'm going to drop the chrysanthemum. Oh, for God's sakes. Take the feathers, would you, Radio? Just take the stupid feathers. You need them, and you want them, and they've got to be in your inventory. Okay, so the trader's off in that direction there. Let's, let's go up on top of this hill. We'll work our way up this hill here, though, real fast. I've got I've got a little bit of wood, stuff like that. We'll let that guy go. I'm not too concerned about him. There's tons of zombies to kill in the game. Oh, we're running out of space. Somebody's in some trouble down here. Uh, 
Is that a punker? He must have got himself on a cactus and lost a leg, huh? Is that a thing? Let's just beat him over the head. What's this here? We could easily get the seeds again. No big deal. I'm more interested in this, this free food and the aloe plants for bandages, for sure. Let's get on up this hill here. I may be doing some things uh, wrong here. Just let me know if I'm making any mistakes. I know the paper is good for, I think it's the shotguns, right? Uh, shotgun shells and stuff, but I'm not at the point where I can do that, so I will be looking for paper down the road and keeping it. But right now, we've only got so much space. Trader gel is up here. Okay, beautiful. Oh, the desert has been... The desert is a lifesaver, so let's go back to favorites. Uh, I favorited the aloe. Last time I was fighting in the desert, I want to hurt myself with a cactus. Oh, that took her arm right off. Oh my god, that's horrible. Oh, poor thing. Oh, took your head off too. Oh, honey. Antibiotic. Oh, sweet mama. Um, um, okay, you stay there. We're going to take these arrowheads. We're going to scrap these guys. And oh, there we go. So the honey will take care of infection. If we ever get infected, we've got honey now. Oh, that's, 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 that's awesome. That is awesome. All right, cool, 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 cool. <laughs> I'm all over the board. I'm so nervous. Okay, so now we're in snow. We had a house that we were looking at, right? There was, there was, there, there's another house right over there. Is this guy in the snow? Oh, crap. I'm watching for wolves. I'm watching for the wolves. I see a tree stump up here, though. These guys carry honey, too. And lumberjacks. Oh, what do we got now? Level up. You are now level six. 19 skill points to spend. Oh, sweet. All right, guys. We're, we're, we're moving in the right direction. I'm, I'm afraid I'm throwing some stuff away that I shouldn't be throwing away, but I, I just can't see myself leaving a bunch of chests laying around uh, and not, um, you know, having to come back for them. Well, here's the house right over here. Oh, there's the trader. Okay, there's the trader. Lumberjack. Oh, I'm hunted. He's coming. Hey, big fella. Ready to go meet your maker? Oh my god, that went right through his head, I think. And there we go. Beautiful. Perfect. Right to the head. Nice. A cloth fragment off of him. Leather would have been better. We do need leather, but we're not seeing any wildlife. That's for sure. We certainly are not seeing wildlife. What do we got here? Is this some place that we could maybe set up a little, a little uh, stop here? Oh, I don't want that sandwich. Get it out of here. Get that out of here. Oh, you know what? I think this house here, doesn't it have a, um, a forge in it? There's a lumberjack right up there. He may cause us some problems. There's a car right there, too. Um, let's, let's go tab. We have a storage chest made. I think what we're supposed to do is put it up here, right? Let's take that out of here. We don't need this and stuff. We're going to drop everything we don't need right now. Uh, the lead. That. This here we need right down here. We're going to keep the honey jar safe. We don't want to lose that. The night vision goggles. 
There's some more aloe vera plant stuff. Uh, the feathers will keep. The jars, uh, actually the jars will throw in there too. Cloth fragments, just in case we need them. Here's some food for us. We've got some frames, we don't need the glue. Let's do this. I'll have to pick up some more of this aloe vera plant stuff. Let's check this stump real quick. I think I want to go take out that... Oh, what was that? Oh, not inventory tab. What was that? Hunting rifle. Oh, it's a hunting rifle barrel. Dang it, I was hoping it was the whole rifle. <laughs> it's not. All right. That's that. I've, I've got to use that gun. That was, a, that was a pretty fun gun to use. So let's go take out this, uh, this lumberjack that's over here and see about that car. Let's go see a guy about a car. Oh, there's a path that leads all the way through here, too. Where is the town, man? We're, we're kind of striking out on finding a town. Nope. Oh, crouch. Oh, there we go. Undetected. Oh, too soon. Oh, that wasn't too soon. Oh, he was grabbing his... I think I shot him in the crotch. I think that was a bad thing to do. He's got kind of a sway to him. Oh, that was the wrong sway. Oh my god, I missed it again. Keep your hands to yourself, buddy boy. I don't think so. There we go, beautiful. Number three. Wow, you're, you're durable, dude. Oh. It's that little right swing he does when he's walking. That's when you got a time it looks like. What's the hubcap for? An old hubcap can be used as part of a recipe to make a homemade landmine. Oh, really? Oh, is that so? Let's check up on top of this hill real quick. There's a main road. Oh, maybe we should be following a main road. Is that a good idea, you guys? Is it good to follow the main roads around? I've been kind of going cross-country so far. I'm not sure, and I know this stuff I can chop up for stone. We're okay on stone right now, but let's check out this house. Actually, let's go over and see the trader. I don't think, our, well, we had some oil that we could sell him, huh? I think the oil is about the only thing we've got that he would probably want to buy off of us right now. And this house is going to have zombies in it for sure. Let's take that. I'm going to hold on to these guys because I think those are pretty cool. Uh, brass, wow, that's 45 brass to melt down. And that's a, that's kind of a cheap gun barrel, too. Let's go see if we can get... Uh, oh, what did I just do? Oh, jeez. Um, <laughs> cloth. I, he'll buy the cloth, too, I believe. Um, coal. I just grabbed the wrong stuff and threw it into my inventory. That's for antibiotics, the moldy bread. I know that. Um, okay, so let's take that stuff right there. I'm going to grab this and this. And we're going to take our walk right through the desert here. We're going to watch for buzzards. And we're going to grab a little something, see if we get some, some dukes, some dukes, some dukes, some dukes. All right. Yeah, I am really uh, enjoying the survival aspect of this game. It really is making me work hard. It makes me wonder if I'm going to actually be able to do it. Um, it, it seems uh, pretty, pretty difficult, but then again, I'm just starting out, so, you know. With your guys' help, I think I'll be fine. You guys, your help has been tremendous so far. And I, I love, I love the uh, the interaction between us. I think it's it's really key to uh, making it fun. Uh, okay, so we're good on this side. Let's go tab. How's our water doing? Let's take a drink. Okay, we got that good. Okay, go back to B. Let's see, how's our food? Our food, we could use a little help there. Uh, oh, we're eating the, the yuccas. We're just going to eat, keep eating the yucca fruit. We'll just walk and eat yucca fruit. It's cheap and free. We'll just pick up some more as we go. It's pretty sweet. And then we've got these, uh, 
The snow is like right around the edge of this whole thing. It's crazy. Uh, looks to me like it's in one piece too. I know some people are having some trouble with their uh, their structures not generating properly, but this one looks like it's okay. All right, quest completed. Let's see if he's got anything around here that we can take. No. Paper. Oh, is this working? Bullet tips. Empty, destroyed cement mixer. I mean, this is okay to loot his stuff, right? I believe it is. Oh, there's another grill. Holy crap. That's awesome. Some water. I'll take that any day. Water seems to be one of my most difficult things to um, acquire and uh, hold on to. There's some stairs back here. What's in here? Maybe this is some stuff we can... Ooh. Oh, what's this? This is plus 10, that was plus 3, so I think this one's no good. Um, okay, I need to just go sell some of this stuff off to him first, I think, is what I need to do. Let's do that. We'll just keep eating this stuff while we do this. Let's go inside and... Oh, there you are. Hey. Make it snappy. I gotta take a crap. He's gotta take a crap. Okay, let's, um, let's sell the oil. Oh, we got some dukes, baby. Sell price five dollars. You know what? I think I'd rather scrap that actually. Gunpowder. No sell price on that. The rifle barrel, 47 bucks. Okay. We don't really need it. The grill. Oh, wait a second. Uh grill. Six dollars. Okay, we'll just keep those. <coughs> Chairs. <laughs> Two dollars. Okay, and how about this hoodie? This is a plus 10. It's blue, too. I should probably wear that one. Hold on a second. All right, now that we're done doing business, get out of my store. Well, that's, that's pretty damn rude, dude. Uh, let's wear that. And let's take this one. And rip... I'll just scrap it. And we're going to scrap the chairs. And we're going to scrap these bullets. These bullet heads. And I think... Okay, there we go. All right, so we're we're done. So we've got a, a few dukes. We got a few dukes. Nothing nothing big, but let's finish uh, let's finish looking around this place here real quick. Is this working? It's a destroyed, untouched Ford. I could take that barrel. I don't know why I want it, but I know I can put gasoline in it. I think. Okay, we're going back to the lockers. Ooh, what's this here? Is there, there must be a zombie outside. Oh my god! Somebody gave me a gun. Oh. Okay, hold on. Let's put this back in the toilet. Let's go to our inventory. Let's scrap that. We'll get the, we're gonna take the cloth. We're gonna scrap that. I love that jacket though, man. That's nice looking. Uh, we're gonna scrap that hubcap. Well, can we? Can we? Okay, so we can't do anything with that right now. All right, but I do want this pistol. It's not a big deal, pistol, but uh, that'll work. It's a pistol. Oh, here's a chemistry station. Untouched. Ooh, plastic. Okay. Well, this is a cool place. Look at this place. That is pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome. Little bridge going down this way. He's got some spikes up here just in case. That's pretty awesome. I like that. Okay, do, do they sometimes have crops in here? Is there any kind of... Oh, there's corn. Okay, there's corn. Uh, do I have any space in my inventory? Uh, we're going to scrap that too, and then we're going to take this corn. Uh, 
That's all I can take? I guess that's all I can take. Six corn. Okay, so I got six corn to make seeds out of so we can grow corn. What are these guys over here? Empty vending machine. What, what am I? What's, what's wrong with me? Uh, B. What's wrong with me? Water 47. Am I too hot? Oh, 104 degrees. Oh, heck yeah, I'm hot. Okay, so tab. Let's, um... Uh, let's drink one of our green teas. And let's take this off right here. Maybe that'll help cool us down a little bit. 105 degrees. Oh no, it's, it's the temperature's still going up. What if I stand in the shade? Wait, there's a yucca juice, isn't there? Uh, let's go yucca. Yucca juice. Let's, uh... Let's craft a couple of those. Let's see what happens. I think that's supposed to cool me down, right? 108 degrees? Ugh, it does feel like Arizona. Okay, so my... it's going down. Temperature's dropping, 105. We hold steady at 105 degrees. Okay, so let's, uh... I think I'm done here. I really wanted to... F is there anything in here that can cool me off? Red tea. Red tea is known for its natural cooling. Oh. Oh, really? Okay, so red tea will cool me off, huh? So is there anything else I can sell to this guy real quick? I'm always going the wrong way. Yep, what do you want? Can I sell that? I'm gonna sell that. It's a hundred. Wow, okay, that's that's some dukes. Um, cloth fragments. Uh, no, we don't need to sell those. And night vision goggles. 166 for those. Uh, we want the sweatshirt. We're gonna have to put that back on. It gets cold in the desert at night. I know that for a fact. Um, okay, don't so let the door hit you on your way out. Don't let the door hit you with a good lord split you, I think is what you mean, sir. Let's buy one of these. Um, a red tea. Let's buy. Come on. And then a yucca juice. I'm gonna head to that house. We're gonna take the pistol too. I love this pistol. I love the handguns. The snake. Uh, we could use the meat off that snake actually. Take the meat off that snake and the leather. There we go, beautiful. And good night, zombie. Good night, I say. You got nothing for me, but I do have a snake. Oh, yeah. Oh, I thought for a second it was going to let me have it because I'm inside his property line here. But that does not look like it's the case. All right, our first snake kill. Oh, yeah. Now, he wasn't too hard to kill either. He actually went down pretty quick. Uh, let's head back over to this house. And uh, what time of day is it? It's only, it's not even noon yet, so we've got some time left. For sure. But I think if we go inside, we should cool down a little bit. I'm going to grab some of this yucca. And this aloe vera. We're definitely going to want more of this yucca juice. Oh, you know what? I bet if I head over here to the snow, I can cool off really quick. Come on, roll around the snowman. 
Roll around. Make yourself a snow angel. Just chill the heck out. Where am I going to find a town, you guys? Holy crap. I don't see a town. Whoa. I don't see a town anywhere out here. Boy, I just don't... I, uh, <laughs> Do we head over this way? I think we're going to head to the east. I think we're going to head to the east next. Let's get our temperature down, though. 100, 108 degrees. Holy crap. That is... Um, that's, that's, that's hot. You, you, you don't want to be that hot. I'm going to chop down a tree just to, just to cool off a little bit more. Let's let him get down to... I noticed 80 degrees... The character doesn't complain at all. Not at all. So maybe that's the key. I don't know. Boy, I've had you guys with me this entire time. I broke away for just a second, but this video is probably going extremely long. So I'll tell you what. Let's end it right there. When we come back, we're going to clear this house out. I think what we are is we are going to head east. We're going to head east and, um, uh, you know, just see if we, maybe we'll follow this path. But we're going to find ourselves a town. We've got to find a town uh, in this next episode someplace where we can start doing some looting other than it being a house. So I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Uh, a little long-winded. Um, some things done. Some things done. Our health has come back up to 87, so we're okay. We're doing all right. We're, we're alive. We're, we're, we're making it. We're making it. Uh, a little zombie action, some looting, a little bit of selling, a little bit of buying. Uh, I'll have to work on that down the road and figure out how that's supposed to be done better. But uh, we've got some dukes now, 253 dukes, uh, and a little bit of everything going on. So I think we can actually put this back on again. There we go, 90 degrees. So Okay, so I'll come back. Next episode, we'll start off with this house, get things kind of organized again, and then we will set off as well to go find uh, the town we want to be in. So I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, hit that like button for me, comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Man 3 and I want you to have an awesome, a fantastic, and a superb day. And I look forward to talking to you again next time.